Welcome to Kentuckiana Real Talk, hosted by Jeremy Ward. If you enjoy the podcast, please subscribe on the podcast provider of your choice and consider subscribing to the Jeremy Ward Team YouTube channel for more expert real estate insights. Now, let's start the show. Morning, it's Jeremy Ward, Ward Realty Services, and today I have the pleasure to interview Andrew Brown with Statewide Mortgage. Andrew has been a, just an extremely awesome partner on the lending side for us, and he comes up with so many creative plans and, and loan packages and stuff. It just it blows me away, but I think it's a lot to do with the experience in the market. You've been around for quite a, quite a long time doing it as myself, and you've seen different markets come and go, and it kind of gives you an idea of what people need. To, right. get, to get something yeah, bought or, or, you know, sold. So I'm excited to talk about the new program you've got, Andrew. Why don't you uh, introduce it to us and tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, absolutely. It's a really, uh, I mean, we've done USDA for a long time, right? Mm -hmm. So this is a USDA program, but it allows us to, you know, basically roll in cost of repairs of up to $30,000. Wow. So that's a game changer for yes. a lot of us, right? Because a lot of people have been pushed out of the market in a lot of ways. Mm -hmm. A lot of our pricing is starting around 200000 and above, you know, mm -hmm. in this area. But there's still a, a lot of people out there that need to be in that 135 to, you know, 180, 189 range. Mm -hmm. This is a great way to find a little flip fixer upper. Sure. That, of course, with the USDA loan, you don't have to have any money down. Mm -hmm. and, that's the, and that's the big difference, right? Plenty of people, you know, if they're going to go into this, they're going to try to flip a house or they're going to do something like that. They've got their own funds and their right. own financing available. Um, and this puts our buyers in that market, right? right. I mean, obviously not a tremendous amount of work can be done, but you can get quite a bit done for twenty five, thirty thousand dollars on a hundred and forty thousand yeah. dollar home. We so we go look at these houses and and you know the, the buyers say they can afford one sixty, one seventy, and the house is one hundred and twenty, and it's a nice location, it's a good neighborhood, but it's just a little bit run down. Well, and you're not going to get financing. You can't get financing on it with the USDA or the FHA or the VA, but with this program, all of a sudden, that's a game changer. Right. Now I can go ahead and borrow the money to make the small repairs, to make it financeable uh, and to be livable. And it, it's just awesome. If you can borrow the money for the house and the repairs, no skin in the game, no money down. Like Exactly. That gives you more options as a buyer in the market. It, it really should. It, re, it really should open up a different market for some buyers that have really been struggling. Mm -hmm. I know you and I have seen that they've really been struggling for the last two years. Yes. Three years, um, especially with rates going up the way that they have. They said these buyers have even gotten pushed out of the market that much more. Yeah. So first, we had just prices overall going up on these houses. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've been doing this for 20 years. Mm -hmm. So some of the houses that I'm seeing going now for $180,000, <laughs> $200,000, we probably would have sold for 115, 120 back in the day. Yeah. Or less. Or less. But that that group has really been pinched out of this market. Mm -hmm. um, and I feel like this will open that up for them. A, a lot of them don't even understand the rural housing program in general. Mm -hmm. The fact that you have no money down, 100% financing, low mortgage insurance, and very low interest rates. And a, and a decent credit score. It doesn't right. take an 800. No. I mean, we can get them done in the between the anything above 600, really. That's I mean, then that's saying something. Yes. You know, it gets a little tougher below 620, but we're doing them every month. Mm -hmm. So obviously, 650, 660, 680 is great, but it, the lower credit scores, and this is a perfect product for them. So if they can go in there and they can take that extra 15, 20,000, they could buy appliances with that, put in brand new carpet with that paint with that Windows. now it doesn't stretch out as much on a three hundred thousand dollar home right right but on a hundred and fifty thousand dollar house that's a big difference i seen one of lanesville the other day it was one hundred twenty thousand dollars and it would have been a perfect candidate for this program because house is 120 i'm sure there was some negotiation room there but it looked like it needed maybe thirty forty thousand dollars of work and it'd been a really nice place right. and it was just a lot of cosmetics but yep. it really wouldn't qualify from what i could tell for a traditional USDA without this, you know, this extra product added to it. So I think if people are listening, like they can go back and look at these lower end, say price homes now because they can get the, the money borrow against it to fix it up and make it the way they need it prior to closing. Really? Right. Exactly. And so VA is another one. And that one really blows me away because I have so many great veteran clients that really deserve a home. You know, they've done everything. They've given it all. 
and maybe their income's not enough to get up into these higher end homes. Now, a VA gets to borrow 100%, but I've never seen a program that lets them borrow money on top of that to, re- right. to fix up the home. I think the most exciting part is, is the limit of the amount of money that they will loan you on top of the house, Andrew. How $100, much is that? $100,000. dollars hundred k right. for repairs. So now you're talking about a whole other, and like oh you said, these are people that have given it all. Yes. And so if we can structure something for them or we can put something together for them that will allow them, again, to buy that home that they wanted, but put in the new refrigerator and the new stove and new carpet. I mean, you name it. Deck, Anything windows. other than really structural changes yeah. they can do. New deck, anything like that. I mean, what can you do with a hundred thousand dollars? A lot. Even on a, let's say a hundred and eighty nine to two hundred thousand dollar home. What can you do with a hundred thousand dollars? Or better yet, what can you do with that on a hundred and ten thousand right. dollar home? Right. You could pretty really, much rebuild it. Right. You could flip it. <laughs> yeah. Nothing wrong with that. That's not a bad word, right? I mean, right. you could absolutely go in there, use that money, repair the loan, repair the home up, and then Put it back on the market with you guys in six to eight months mm-hmm. and make a little profit on that. Is there any limitation how many times they can use this product? No, so no. They could just keep doing this and, and build an equity, build an equity. And, Absolutely. The and biggest thing with, with USDA, of course, you know, they can only own one home at a time. Right. So that's the biggest thing. But if they're going to continue to go on up, there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing saying that they can't turn around, fix this home up, put it on the market, sell it, and just slowly build that up for themselves. And that's big. Same like- with VA. A lot of our buyers are, are 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 thinking like that. They're like, I want to get a house, but a little bit of equity, I'll move up to my second house. Just don't have it, the funds. It's just getting in that first one. Usually, once you get to your first one, right. usually you can keep stepping up and without, learn a little bit, figure yes. it out. I mean, a lot of people they see the flips, they see the Chip and Diane, they see all this stuff, but they don't have the funds to do right. that. Right. They don't. I mean, most of our flippers, most of our people that are doing this, these investors, they've got deep pockets. Yeah. They've got the ability to do this. Um, this opens that up for them, you know, and it lets them get into this market. I don't know how many people are like, oh, I've got this great house and I just need an extra ten thousand dollars to fix it up. Well, we don't really have that loan. You know, right. we've got it through some FHA programs right. that are out there. and We've had those for a long time. But the difference here, I think, is the 100% financing. No down payment. The no down payment. <laughs> and then to be able to roll that $30,000 on top of that. Now, they do need to realize they need to use a general contractor, mm-hmm. which I would think most of them want to do anyway. Sure. Um, so they can't just do the work themselves. So there is some costs that they need to consider in that situation there. But other than that, there really aren't any rules to this that we don't follow with the normal USDA and VA you know, uh, loans. Now, VA doesn't have um, a geographic limit, but USDA does, right? So basically nothing in Jeffersonville, nothing in New Albany, nothing in Clarksville. But the entire outskirted area all qualify for 100% financing. Mm -hmm. I mean, again, I don't think everybody fully even understands that product. Right. So, yeah, I mean, you were talking about it before. I mean, a lot of what we do... It, it it it's hey square peg meet round hole. Yeah, I mean that's just how are we, we going to get this to work? <laughs> yeah, that's just what we do. And if you're looking for the cookie cutter loan that everybody can do, um, yeah, this this isn't this isn't your your niche, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, we do every kind of loan out there, but to be able to offer all those different options, I think that's what separates statewide apart yeah. from from most other people. Yeah, because I can send you know a lot of clients are asking me, well, can I do this? Can I do that? Can I buy this house without selling mine? And, Really, I can do anything as long as you're financially able to do it. And the first step is talking to that lender and figure out what you can do, what's comfortable to be done, then get back with me, and then I'll put a plan together. Exactly. But that's the first step, guys, is like getting with your lender. And and I would recommend you to call Andrew because he's got a toolbox full of stuff. I tell my clients all the time, you may want to do this, you may want to do that, but he's got a whole box of varieties Then you yeah. two will get them together and you'll figure out what's best for the client. And then I can go to work. And that, that is what we do best, right? I mean, it's that tandem working back and forth mm-hmm. in that way. I, too many times I see realtors out there showing five, six, seven, eight, ten houses, mm-hmm. and then you find out the customer's got a 550 credit score. Mm-hmm. You know, so now two things have happened. What I see, the customer's all excited, yeah. and they're looking at homes, and then they come to find out, you know, they're talking to their parents, and they're talking to their family and friends, and, oh, yeah, I've looked at this house. I love it. We've looked at ten houses, and this is the one. It's not the one because you got a 550 credit score. Now, I've never turned anyone down before in my life. We will put everyone on the path to home ownership. Mm -hmm. But this isn't probably going to be your house because as you and I both know, it's going to be gone. Mm -hmm. 
It's going to take me three months, four months to fix that 550 up and to teach them what they need to do. If they would just get pre-approved first, it would take all of that stress off the table because there aren't other houses. There aren't other things involved. There's not other realtors involved. They get pre-approved. They know exactly what they qualify for. We go over those options. A lot of times it's like, hey, you got a 620 and that's going to limit you here. But if you do this, this, and this, I'll get you a 680, and that's going to open up a whole different category. Yeah. We were working with one of your agents, Whitney Melvin, and we had a customer that had a no score. And we told the customer, listen, we can do no scores, but pump the brakes for just a second. Let's do a few things here. And within a very short amount of time, she now has a 690, yeah. and she's ready to go, and she's so excited. And this actually might be a great program for them, the right. USDA 100% with the, with the cost of repairs built in. So. People just really need to get pre-approved up front so that then we can turn them over to you guys and we can say, hey, actually, this fits their box better and, and they can stretch a little further out because they're comfortable with this payment now that we've got their credit adjusted. And, you know, just the total ex opposite of that has happened to me where I've been out with people and they're a little hesitant to get pre-qualified and they think that they can afford this. And we're looking at maybe a neighborhood that's got a variety of, you know, different styles and sizes and prices. They... They can afford this home, but they really like that home. It's about fifty thousand miles or more, but they haven't got pre-qualified. And I'm like, look, guys, I, you know, I'm gonna either if you don't get pre-qualified, I'm gonna take you out. And you're gonna get excited about something you can't afford, which is gonna suck. Yeah. Or you're gonna go out here and buy something that that maybe fits the bill. It's not exactly what you wanted when you could afford the house next door that you really wanted. Exactly. Because it was within your price range, you just didn't know it. So I see that happen too, guys. Like, get out and talk to their lenders and find out exactly what your options are, because you might be shooting yourself in the foot, you could have bought the house next door that you wanted anyway and, and been super happy. So it, it all starts with the lender. And then when I've got that, I've got that letter from the lender, man, I could go to bat for you and we can get something done. Well, and, and everybody's comfortable with it. You can make an aggressive offer at that point. You can know, hey, I'm, I'm stronger than I thought I was. You know, this is a conventional loan at the, or this is a different type of, you know, and we're just not giving ourselves the full advantage of being able to do that when we're not getting pre-approved up front, when we don't know. And, and, and pre-approved, you I mean, you're just finding out what those hurdles are going to look like before yeah. you get to them, you know, as opposed to, oh, here's the customer, but they love this house and they, you know, and we need to get pre-approved tonight. We need, uh, okay, we can do that. Yeah. But it just, it makes for an experience that the customer has to go through that really isn't necessary. You know, and your guys are really, really good about getting your buyers pre-approved up front before they start showing houses. But a lot of agents aren't. And I think that puts a lot of stress on buyers. Well, the seller, the seller's not feeling real rosy about somebody that, wait, you made an offer on my house, but you're not really pre-approved yet. Am I going to tie this house up? Because right. there's probably another offer coming at the market we've been in. Uh, and I just, yeah, it's the only way to go. I mean, I'll take people out and show them houses, but it's that conversation is going to come up within first one or two, one or houses. two houses. I want right? to get out. I want to meet you. I want to see what you Good like. Good faith. Yes. You know, uh, but that one, after that one or two houses, there's just no reason not to be pre-approved. I mean, if, um, you're just setting your buyer up for heartache. You're behind the ball starting out and then all of a sudden you're rushing through the paperwork. You're trying to get everything to the lender that should have already been done. And then we're in the middle, we're doing inspections, we're doing appraisals, and you're still trying to get paperwork to the lender. It can be a mess. It, it, uh, really, it, it really helps when we start off on solid ground with a pre-approval. I totally agree. And, and hopefully this new product allows us to extend that pre-approval into a different range, a yeah. different type of home. And that's what I'm really excited about. I'm excited about. about it because I've seen those looks on people's face where they're just going to get out of the market because they, you know, they're finding houses, but they need work and they can't borrow the money. Oh. Now they can. Now they can. Ninety percent of the homes out there, I get you any, especially hundred yeah. percent of them if you're a vet. Like we, that qualifies and for so every they area, be, right? They I mean, should they be. deserve that. Yes. But now to be able to offer this other option, I, I really think it's a game changer because, man, we've walked in hundred twenty nine thousand dollar homes, really and much. we know that the customers like, man, you know, they're looking around, they're like, this is what I'm going to get. You know, and I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get financing for this. Right. Now it's like, well, no, this is not what you're going to get. You're going to get this with brand new carpet, brand new appliances, all new paint. Whatever you want. That's a whole house. Yeah. Where do you want to spend your $30,000? You <laughs> I mean, you can stretch 30000 out a long way a long in buying in that price point. So yeah. I'm really excited for it. I think it's going to be a really good product for us moving forward. Let me ask you this, uh, maybe a little off script, but you know, you do a lot of amazing programs. One of them is your buy down program. Yes. And it's absolutely 100% as, of all the programs I've seen out there, you've got it nailed. This is a buy down for the life of the loan. This is not 
first year, second year, third year. This is the life right. of the loan. And we've done the math. It saves you hundreds of thousand dollars as a client to go this route. Yeah. Are you still able to offer buy downs with this program? Oh yeah, something? absolutely. Okay. Yeah, that's not gonna change. That's something that we're gonna be offering and have been offering and it's worked out really well for our buyers. Yeah, I see that three, two, one buy down. I can do that loan. I just don't recommend it. Yeah. I feel like really more than anything, it, it pays the loan officer, but it doesn't pay the client. Yeah. It, in, uh, in the long run, um, you still have to qualify at the highest at the interest highest rate. rate. So you haven't become so you haven't more done affordable. Any, no, you've become less <laughs> yes. affordable. You have to qualify at that 3% higher rate than what you're getting. And then the reality of it is it doesn't make any sense because for the life of the loan, you can get a rate a percent to a percent and a half lower than anything you're seeing out in the market anyway. Yeah, I think the market rate I've seen today was like six and a quarter, six and a half roughly. Well, you do the uh, and math. this is January, right? This is January 2024. Uh, with a buy down, uh, just a general buy down with, you know, general credit, it was down to like five and a quarter. We, we love this program. It, it is, is strong, strong man. <laughs> and, I mean, that takes you from being able to, you know, if you can only afford 200 at six and a quarter, you're going to be well over 200 at five and a quarter. Oh, yeah. Well over. No and, question about it. I mean, we're just, able to add an extra 60000 depending on whatever, uh, of the loan size, right? But, I mean, we're able to save the customer anywhere from 180 to $300 on their payment. When you start talking about buy-downs on $350,000, $400,000 house, it's huge. you're talking about $300, $250, $300 on each payment. Times 12. That's a game times changer. Times 30 years. <laughs> That's putting you in a different price point. Yes. And that's the idea of that program as well. And we'd be able to look at that and saying, okay, this is a $180,000, $190,000 buyer, but we can now get them in that $220,000, $225,000 price point, offering them the same price and a payment that they would have had at $189,000. It is a no-brainer, but again, yeah. there's not enough information about it out yeah. there on the market. And it's easy to say, oh, well, no, I don't know about that. Because we do do our buy down. We yeah. do it differently. Yeah. We make sure that it, it it advantages the customer and not the loan officer. Right. It's, you know, I've that's seen. the point of a buy down. You should be able to look at that and think, man, I could have afforded this home, but now I get to afford this home at the same payment that the bank has quoted me over here. Mm -hmm. And if that's not it and you're not seeing that in the buy down, then the loan officer is getting paid and you're not. They got a bonus. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Seller paid bonus. <laughs> and it's a great program. It, it is. just can get manipulated. And, and that works for USDA, Any loan. FHA, VA, conventional, whatever loan package that Andrew gives you, you can do the buy down on. Just an amazing product. I, I want to make sure we brought that up. No, I appreciate that. And I know, not enough people know even about with our program. new construction with Murphy Homes, you all have already got that worked out. That's right. buy down all day long. Uh, Chase Murphy is absolutely guaranteed a buy down on every everything. one of his new construction homes. And I don't think enough realtors are talking about that because they yeah. get confused with the three, two, one and all this. This is a permanent for the life of the life loan of the buy down. You're qualified You're going to save at life. least a percent off of what anybody else would quote that for. And you're going to qualify. So you qualify because it's a permanent buy down. You qualify on that lowest rate, not on the highest rate. Right. Because what now you've done is you've taken that hundred and eighty nine, or you've taken that two hundred twenty five thousand dollar buyer, and because you're saying, well, it's three percent is what I got to qualify for. You're qualifying them at one eighty nine, right? But the loan officer's getting paid. Yeah, he is. <laughs> so no, we're flipping that. Your hundred eighty nine thousand dollar borrower, he needs to be able to get into that two hundred twenty five thousand dollar house. Yep. For the same price. For the same price. That's what we do, right? I mean, yep. that's why we got into doing what we do. It's a leg up. Yeah. I mean, it's. I, I'm I'm amazed that, that my phone's not just blowing up every time I talk about it. And I think it's just maybe it's my, maybe I'm not explaining it right. Right. No, I think you've done a great job. But, There's only so much you can be out in the market. And if the if the information is getting pushed down, then it, it's not getting explained to the buyer. Yeah. And that that is something you guys do a good job of. You guys are explaining to all your buyers. Hey, look, this is what a buy down is supposed to do for you. This is what it should look like for you. Now you incorporate that. With this extra $30,000 that we can get them on these products, game changer. I've got you a cheap rate. I can get you money to buy the house and repair it and no money down. And Nothing. If you want to become an investor, you want to turn around and sell this house in six months? Let's it's go to the next you. one. You just Do this five going. times. Yeah. You won't have a mortgage payment. And, and I can't get that program. I can't get the USDA. I can't get the VA. I didn't serve. So I've got to put skin in the game every right. time I flip. And I think it's a great way for people.
people starting out to get into it the really flipping is. game. If you and thought no about it going at in. all, it is a great way to put – and what a great investment for our, for our young buyers. Uh, that, again, the millennial buyers that have been pinched out of this market, yes. I really feel like this is a product that, a that could just explode, especially in our area. Yeah, it's not everywhere that you can go, and you can still find hundred twenty nine thousand yeah. dollars <laughs> homes. Let's be real, right? You know, but in our area, you can. Yeah, and to buy them at a hundred percent, no money down, get a great low interest rate, and give you another thirty thousand dollars on top of that to fix it up. Every parent should be talking to their kid yeah. about this program. Honestly. It's a no brainer. It, it fits. It's a no brainer. Yeah. Well, what's the best way to get a hold of you if they have any interest in any programs uh, sure. for as long? Yeah, you can call me at 502-407-4377, or you can email me, abrown at statewidemortgage.com. Those are the two best ways. Um, it has been a phenomenal year. I do want to thank you guys. Hey. Um, it has been an incredible year. I think we did over, I did personally over $26 million in, wow. in business this wow. year. And Good most job. of it is coming from Ward Realty wow. and just the partnership that we've put together. So it has been, uh, it's been a blessing to work with you guys. It's, it's been mutual here too, man. It's, it's a good fit. We, I think we all think like out of the box trying to solve problems because we've seen how the problems can stall the market. Yeah and stall people's future. You know, there's no, it is not fair. Uh, I shouldn't say fair, but it, it sucks that people's out there hardworking, especially vets, that's giving it all and they can't get something to live in for their family. I think this will put them in it. This, it flips the script. It, it really so. does. I, it, it offers, you know, we did what, 100, I did about 130 loans last year. I, I really could see this product kicking it up another, you know, maybe another 25, 30%. Yeah. I mean, this is a good, this is a, a, it just needs to be explained. Yeah. And as long as we get out there and do our job, you know, and, and let the borrowers know what's available to them. I think there's so many good programs. There's other, pro there's so many good programs out there, but the borrowers don't understand what's available to them. And, they and so they don't know how to take advantage of that. And, and that comes down to the realtor. Well, and I think that's where the trust factor comes yeah. in with the realtor. Like they really got to trust their realtor to kind of open that financial veil of where they're at. And I think, you know, for you buyers out there, maybe you're not working with a realtor. Maybe you're, thinking about getting in the market, you've heard about this. You're like, oh my gosh, I can't really find anything in the area I want to be in, right? Like on the MLS or on Zillow. So here's what I would say to you. If there's a house in your neighborhood that looks like maybe it's run down, maybe you know that somebody's yes. passed away, that there's trouble there, give me or Andrew a call. We'll look into it. We'll get the info for you. You may be able just to buy that house in your neighborhood, be close to whoever you want to be exactly. close to. We can kind of get you there just be just because it don't have a for sale sign in the front yard doesn't, doesn't mean, mean it couldn't be bought, right? <laughs> right. So Absolutely. that's part of flipping too. Yeah. So for you guys that, you know, seen these and houses. And get you the money to fix it up. Yes. That's the game changer. That's where you get pushed out of the market is you'll find those homes, but you don't have the money to fix it up. Yeah. Ask yourself, what could you really do with $30,000 in repairs? Or if you're a vet, 100 k <laughs> I think it's a great program. It's, it I'm is. looking forward to 2024. It's going to be a good year. Yep, yeah. yep. And, you know, it's a good feeling to be able to I, – I flip myself. I'm not a huge sure. flipper. I usually keep them and rent them. But just going in and fixing these homes, bringing them back to life, yeah, it's going to serve me and my family, but if I make it nice, it's going to serve generations in the future. Absolutely. And it just excites me seeing these old places come back with some new life. So yeah, absolutely. Appreciate everybody uh, watching today. If you would like any more uh, local real estate information, please like and subscribe to the Jeremy Ward Team YouTube channel. I appreciate it. Yeah, thanks for coming All in, right, brother. Yep. We'll keep pushing. <laughs>